very patched up for 7.0. I was wondering when this was going to come out. Looking back at the previous expansions, it was usually a day before maintenance. But because we had a 48 hour maintenance, there was always some chance that this came out today. But I don't know. I just I was like, ah, maybe they will, maybe they won't. But we have it here. So, good news is. You'll be able to get a few quest locations so you can park your character where you want to. It's also the final day for prep if you're going to do something like your challenge logs. Don't forget to do those. Set them up so you have the dungeon roulette ones and the regular dungeon ones. One from completion, fate ones. Just a couple of extra things that you can do today before the servers go down tomorrow morning. But with that, I'm sure we have a lot to read through, so let's get through the patch 7.0 notes. Reminder that the normal version of the Arcadian raid is two weeks after the official launch on July 16th. I have a lot to do today, and I'm not in the right headspace to do it. Actually, I don't want to do any of it. Reading for class has been uh, tedious. It's almost chore-like. I'm just not enjoying the classes, and I usually do, so I don't know. I do have a lot for this week, and mainly that's a lot of reading. My third class for the summer started on Monday, and there's an overlap between this course and the two others from the first half of summer. So that's a lot of reading and a lot of processing and mental power and will, and I'm a little bit burnt out at the moment. Yesterday, half my morning was work, reading, and writing and watching the lectures. But what I found is that today I don't want to. So how do you do something when you don't want to do it anymore, when you're on the verge of burnout? I guess the trick is a little at a time. Let's try that and see how that works. So first on the list, and I'm a little behind because of laziness. I need to read for my teaching history class. That's gonna be about two hours. I don't wanna do it, but I have to do it. So let's load up the document on my Kindle. Okay, so now I've sent them to the Kindle. It might take a while processing, whatever. What I also like to do to save some time is I will run my readings through a program called atlas.ti. This will help me generate codes so that I can see where certain topics are appearing in whatever it is that I'm reading articles or I don't know if it's gonna work for this. Um, but we can try it. When it does work, it's helpful. When it doesn't work, not too bad because I'm going to read through the article anyways and make annotations. But this is just a little bit helpful, especially when I have to draw back for discussion purposes or when I'm citing or referencing. That's why I like to do this code. So I'm going to do that now. And there we go. Now my document is coded and I can see the topics and where certain things are mentioned throughout the paper. This really helps me. Uh, like I said, I'm still going to read through the paper because, you know, personal synthesis. Uh, I, I would rather rely on my own mind and going through things uh, and helping me understand the text as opposed to a computer program. Uh, but it is useful. So now I can see where certain things are being mentioned and make note of that when I'm going through my reading. Okay, let's head over to the Kindle and check if our documents went through so we can start reading. Okay, so I don't know why, but my documents aren't being sent over to my Kindle. I guess this is a sign that I shouldn't be reading and that I should go relax and watch TV in the living room. I think that's what the universe is telling me. So maybe my plans of being lazy, uh, I don't know, we're all part of the universe's plan.
Oh well. Oh, my, uh, my reading is finally loaded, so I guess I can start reading. After, after this episode, though, I really like it. Watching it's always sunny in Philadelphia. I haven't seen this series in years, so it's great to go back and revisit it. You know, this whole business of reading and analyzing text gets a lot easier the more you do it. Undergrad me, I don't think I could have ever done this. I probably would have given up and been playing video games or continued binging. It's always sunny. But it's something that I really love to do, and that's how come I'm pursuing my PhD. Despite the fact that sometimes I don't want to do anything, this is actually really fun for me. Just reading through a text, trying to see what is being said, what is being argued, identifying points, writing my own thoughts in the margins. I really live for this stuff. Oh, it smells so good. I'm making lunch, by the way. Mm, rice and chicken. Started working out, so I need the protein. I swear, it's like the universe does not want me to work. Check what just happened. So I'm trying to get onto my school's portal so that I can, you know, watch the rest of my lecture videos and work on my assignment that I have due on Sunday. And I keep getting this. So maybe it is a don't work day. It's, it's the universe's plan. That's just that's just what I'm going to do. Okay, so all the stuff that I did not want to do, I've been slowly knocking it off. I, I'm sorry about my hair. I don't know where my hat went off to. But I have been slowly knocking out everything on my list begrudgingly. It's now tea time and time to watch my lecture videos. But I'm kind of happy because I'm going to hang out with the fiancé. We're going to wash the car and just relax and enjoy the rest of the super hot... Texas afternoon. Well, I'll see y'all in the next video.